Have you ever felt a bond with someone so deeply intense? A powerful yearning that your whole body feels as if it's physically tingling each time you're with that person. It's certainly a different, unusual sensation compared to other relationships you've had. And that feeling and connection don't go away even after months, years or decades, despite being away from each other and being with a number of different people, despite heightened emotions and endless fights. But you can't deny it. You two have crazy chemistry that just won't go away. Are you ready to find out if your twin flame is trying to connect with you? Here's a list we've put together of 12 crazy signs your twin flame is communicating with you. Number one, you dream about your twin flame even before you meet in person. Have you ever experienced vivid dreams where you felt a familiar presence, someone you don't know in real life, but you instantly warmed up to as if you've already met them in the past? And then you wake up with a strong desire to meet this person? The presence you felt in those dreams is likely your twin flame even before you've realized you have one and they're trying to communicate with you. You may have even shared a dream with them at some point. While you sleep, your energetic body is much freer than while you're awake. And because of this, your soul is attracted to your twin flame soul with more ease. It's simply the easiest way to connect and they're naturally drawn to do so. Dreaming about your twin flame and dreaming with them is a way of the universe to bring your senses together and strengthen the relationship that you will soon come to enjoy. Number two, you feel drawn to them. A twin flame bond feels almost magnetic. From that very moment, you looked into each other's eyes when you walked into that coffee shop. The attraction is undeniable. You feel inexplicably drawn to that person. The pull never seems to dwindle, as if their energy is always there, always pulling you to be closer to each other. Even when you're far apart, whether you're staying in another room or you're halfway around the world. If you feel as if there's an overwhelming pull towards someone, as if you can't resist, whether you've only met them or someone who's been in your life for a long time, then this could be a sign that your twin flame is connecting with you. Number three, a gifted advisor confirms it. The signs above and below in this video will give you a good idea of whether your twin flame is communicating with you. Even so, it can be very worthwhile to speak to a highly intuitive person and get guidance from them. They can answer all sorts of related questions and take away your doubts and worries. Like, are they really your twin flame or soulmate? Are you meant to be with them? I recently spoke to someone from Kasumba after going through a rough patch in my relationship. After being lost in my thoughts for so long, they gave me a unique insight into where my life was going, including who I was meant to be with. I was actually blown away by how kind, compassionate and knowledgeable they were. I've linked to Kasumba in the description below. Check it out to get your own love and twin flame reading. In this love reading, a gifted advisor can tell you whether your twin flame is communicating with you and most importantly, empower you to make the right decisions when it comes to love. Number 4. You feel a strong, unexplainable connection with someone you just met. Out of nowhere, you instantly like someone you just met on a very random, last minute blind date. What were the odds, right? It seems too good to be true, but you can't stop thinking about them. The way they look, the sound of their voice, the smell of their hair, you even start to long for them. Your attraction to this person is so powerful, you desire to be with them when you're not with them, and you want to know everything there is to know about them. This new person who's just entered your life is probably your twin flame. Number five, you feel body sensations when you meet your twin flame. There are several physical sensations you may feel the first time you meet your twin flame. One of the most common feelings is heart palpitations or pain in the heart chakra. Seeing the physical manifestation of your mirror soul for the first time or standing near them makes your heart accelerate. This powerful connection affects the seven chakras of the body, especially the heart chakra. Dizziness also occurs because the first meeting releases powerful energy that creates an extreme vibratory charge. Meeting your twin flame releases an intense explosion of energy that you might not be able to handle. You may also feel pressure somewhere in your body. This is because the chakras of the body are affected by the powerful energy that comes with a twin flame bond. This bond exposes energy imbalance in your body. Another sensation you will feel is stomach pain, usually experienced at the beginning of the relationship. You feel so in love that it physically hurts you to be away from your twin flame. What happens is that the solar plexus chakra is experiencing imbalance and manifests pain. 
This feeling goes away when the relationship becomes stable. Notice your body temperature. The first time you are around your twin flame, you will feel your body turn warm. And when you walk away, you will feel it turn cold. This occurs due to the vibratory energy charge. So powerful that it affects body temperature. Number six, you know what they think and feel without them saying a word. Do you believe in mind reading? It may sound like nonsense, but if someone is communicating to you without even saying a word and you just get it, then that might be your twin flame. Some might call it telepathy, a psychic connection, or a gut feeling. You might even feel a little crazy and think it's only a coincidence at first. But if you can read the mind of someone as if it were your own, then you have a strong spiritual connection that doesn't need words to communicate. You can likely understand with just a look across the room and you know what the other person is thinking. You may even feel what the other is feeling, according to Spinely. Even if you've known them for a short time, you know what they're thinking or feeling. Even if they're in the other room or across the globe, you seem to know what's on their mind. Number seven, you experience intense emotions. The first time you meet your twin flame, your emotions will feel heightened. You suddenly feel an explosion of intense emotions, both positive and negative. You experience a whole spectrum of feelings, happy, ecstatic, sad, depressed, mad, and so on. And everything will feel overwhelming and more intense. There's an emotional charge between twin flames, says Spinely, and they develop quickly because you two feel so familiar. Spiritual author Shannon Kaser also adds that you feel things deeper together because you two are so connected, which often makes for an intensity and passion. In conclusion, any interaction with a twin flame is an exciting yet confusing experience. Hopefully the signs listed in this video will clear up any doubts you have. But if you really want to find out if your twin flame is communicating with you, don't leave it up to chance. Instead, speak to a real certified advisor who will give you the answers you're searching for. I mentioned Kasumba earlier. It's one of the oldest professional psychic services available online. Their advisors are well seasoned in healing and helping people. When I got a love reading from them, I was surprised at how knowledgeable and understanding they were. They helped me out when I needed it most. And that's why I always recommend their services to anyone who has questions about twin flames. Get your own professional love reading in the description below.